Hello everyone and welcome back to more Klonoa Door to Fame to Mile. We're now at the final stage of this game here. And I want to do what I can to complete it all because this is going to be the final part of this let's play here. <laughs> About time though because the first one, uh, the first playthrough part I made was over five months ago. <laughs> so we go to the Moon Kingdom to just, uh, uh, that's just a rise. But here we are, probably some of my favorite locations in any, in in a video game. Oh no, I be careful. I will. Let's go, Hupo. Oh, he's sad. Gadius, his plans. We got to put an end to them. Sure thing. That's what we hear. The legendary kingdom, crush the moon kingdom. Again, this is like some of the most beautiful places I've seen in a, in, in vid games. And I only just gotten into Kano Kano like a year ago or so. And when I played the original PlayStation version, just because the music is so good. This is the one I. It's the one that's in my last video called The Untamed Heart. The music just really hits, really hits, you know? And I also see that the remaster really did it justice. Oh man! I can do it! Yes! But what do you think of this place here? If this is your first time watching it on my video, and you know, didn't play the game, what do you think? Oh, sir, as well as a final stage. So what we have to do is break some crystals, because then all the statues will turn to dust, and then you can move forward. I believe now I have to go this way? And every time we go here, the music changes. And here we are. Mm -hmm. I I even saw the Wii version, and I do all, and then and again, I believe the sheeting was a little more noticeable in that version, since here the sheeting just doesn't quite exist here. We got this beautiful lightning and such, but. There had to be some shading to make it more dimensional. Same with the characters we sometimes see here, like Honoa. What they do mean here is there's a lack of shadow, and shadow may um at all. and for some reason the shadow is always something that remasters are sometimes missing. Oh, come on! I want to jump onto these crystals right there. It doesn't matter though because. I have 24 lives. I can possibly die. Oh my god, okay. Ah, oh, man. Okay, I'm just gonna stay completely still. Good. No, you're not going to make me fall. Not this time. Oh man, I hate it when they do this in the high place. But I survived. But again, the remasters. Um, I was. I seen this big trend where it just completely forgets about the sh uh, the shadows to put in a game, just so that you can easily see what's coming up. Or it just needs it just needs it to make the the whole environments uh, more realistic. Because if not, then everything just looks so shiny, and that can. Kinda of mess up with the eyes, especially with blooming. Blooming and lightning is something to just exaggerate with. Especially Sonic uh, comes on to me, but you get idea already. And now we just have to move forward to the blue statues turn to dust. Here we are. 
Oh wait, I can't go up there. Time to move this way. I really, really hope we're getting a third, uh, a third game in Konoha series after this. I did hear that the fan, uh, the, uh, the PRS, uh, Fancy uh, River series has actually sold really well. So maybe it's a good, uh, maybe it's a good call for for Namco to make more games such as these, because Konoha needs it, and I and I bet a lot of people who played the the first two games. I am really in love with this series already. I am. I mean, I finally get to... I finally get to beat the Klonoa 2 after getting that. I got it day one. And it's now officially one of my fav all-time favorite games. Because the story and the levels are so good. It's one of the most unique games and yet didn't catch a lot of people's attention. Not even in Japan, I hear, because they're awful. Um, uh, they're awful marketing into these games, and somehow it even happens uh, with this remaster here. It's almost like Namco didn't quite get the idea why they failed in the first place. Maybe they just ne never feel confident about the Hanoa series, although they put the, although you can clearly tell they put their, their heart and soul into uh, the first two. So that's why I'm wondering what happens. <laughs> you know because. If you've seen the, how they marketed the games, it's kind of laughable, really. Wait, haven't I been here already? Okay, I'm just gonna check here. I believe I have to go this way. Although I'm not even sure. Okay, I think I have to go this way. Because now destroy the crystal, so uh... okay. Let's check. Oh yes, uh, the green one is destroyed, so we have to go here and here. I just didn't take it hard because I don't need I don't need one. Oh, can I take them in time? I can't. I can't. Oh my god. I oh, forget it. 27 lives! There's no way this cat, uh... Okay, cat is going to die now. No way, sir. I actually do want the reversion, though, <laughs> just because it looks really different. No, 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 no! Okay, I'm gonna try and see if I can carry it all the way. Booyah! There's the yellow crystal. Gonna break? Heck yes! I do have some few complaints about the, the remaster though. I do feel the comp uh, the controls a little less fluid. Like something about this feels a bit more risky when platforming than than it does in the original, which is weird. Because when I see PlayStation One games, I usually think hmm, this might be a little problematic. But <laughs> weirdly, I I do recommend I do like the Wii version. I mean, the PlayStation One version more, just because the fluid controls more. I don't know what else to say, but hey, the remaster is not so shabby. Okay, I can do it. Oh, yes. We're now at the, uh, the core of the Moon Kingdom. So I believe what we have to do now is... Yes, we have to destroy the last crystal. Now. Oh, okay. Alright, it's just an ancient elevator. We don't have to blow stuff. Not yet, anyway. Huh, it only took me... I guess, eight minutes. And now for the second vision. We almost there, people. Almost there to complete this game and save everybody's dreams. 
The time of restoration. What's this? What are you doing here, slave? Oh, sire, we've been waiting for you. My sincere apology. Our kingdom has been over taken over by this guy. Okay, I didn't read it completely. We were careless. He trapped the diva Lephus in an egg, and is now pouring energy from nightmares into it. Mother! What are you talking about, kid? Who's this cat you're taking with? He's not welcome here! It'll be disastrous for everyone. I understand. Mother, keep, please keep yourself out of harm's way. Mother? Who are you, Who are you Hippo? Tell me now! I thought we were, I thought we were friends! Konoa. I'm really... I'm really the prince of the Moon Kingdom, Cress. What? You're a prince? You never told me that. <laughs> the range bearer was my disguise. I had my reasons for treating, uh, treading into the real world. What reasons? I'm sorry. I can't say anything about that now. But I promise. I promise to tell you everything later. Really? He's he's really only you. Oh, I want you to just trust me. Just a little bit more. Could you help us just a little bit more? Konoa. What are you talking about? We've been friends forever, right? Uh, if only that's true. Although... It's weird that they say they've been friends forever, even though it feels like it's, they've only been friends for a few few days. Well, maybe there's a huge skip in the intro. Hupo, we're counting on you. Of course, sir. I mean, mother. Yeah, just go to your bedroom. Now, we have to go and save the world. But Gadius is also a pretty good villain, even though we only see him like three times. Again, a really great location to look at. Something you can just stare at for hours. But really, he only says he wants he wants Kono to trust more because if you want a sword, then you'll probably understand why he says that. I mean, I guess they're friends, but man, it's really. It's really sad to to see Kanoa be just being used like this. What? And still alive. Now what am I going to do? Maybe I should use this guy here. And use this one. Oh. Oh, come on! Man, I feel terrible right now. Finally. Now, I'm just gonna... So, what I believe what we have to do now is... We have to go through some different places where we had to activate some... Uh, some... Yeah, you know, buttons. And then we can actually and then we can move forward to the final boss. I have no idea how to survive that. But I still saved the villagers, so never mind that. <laughs> Don't wanna go through that again. Those are new enemies! They're through. They're from. Um, they're from these boomerangs. All right, just gonna wait. Okay, forget about waiting. Still alive. Uh, what? Lucky good.
Okay, that's good and all, but I really need that one right now. Alright. He's coming, right? Yes, he does. And now I'm gonna use him. And we've activated the door. Or move that crystal right there. After Klonoa, I might want to do another Sonic Let's Play. I just don't know if I have the motivation to do Sonic Frontiers. I finally beat the game, but something in me just feels like it doesn't want to do another Let's Play of it. I mean, want to go back to it just yet. I guess it's just because I'm a bit tired of other worlds that I just want to play a, a traditional Sonic game again. That's just how I am. I mean, the thing about it is, I'm glad we all got a game that we ever all can say is a really great is Sonic game. But at the same time, I'm just tired of open world games that we get every single year. Like, everybody does that right now. And I'm just dead tired of it. I'm just glad I'm not a, a Ubisoft fan anymore. Or else, I would, I would not touch another game again like it. Okay, I just had to see... Yeah, okay, it is this way. I just want we had to go to the right. You know, video games always want us to go to the right. So, we just have to go here again. And since the pillar has moved up, we can now go to another door. We already took that one. Okay, I'm gonna use this. This soundtrack is also quite good as well. It really feels, makes you feel determined to save the day. Come on. No! One more time. I feel like a pro again. Oh wait, first we have to do this. This should be pretty easy. Oh! Okay, I screwed that one up. Um, shouldn't there be another enemy coming here? Oh wait, okay, I guess I have to go out and then in again. I swear they're supposed they're supposed to uh, appear again. Okay, it did, but I feel like I should have done that here. Oh god! Okay, seriously, they're supposed to do this right away. Okay, don't feel again. Mm. Good. Okay, now he wants to appear again. Why didn't you do that before? Got the coin. Okay, one more time. It's definitely a villager. Ah. Uh. Or not. It's just a crystal. Oh! I kind of thought I was going to fall to my death. Oh no! Please leave me alone! That wasn't fair. Now what's up here? Ah, just a button. I remember... I actually remember this This part took me quite, the, uh, quite some time to... Uh, uh, to get done. Because I'm falling most of the time and I can't grab the enemies while they're coming out. This is going to take me some time, doesn't it? 
it. Uh. Okay, finally got it. Now, activate. Finally. That took me minutes. Many minutes. It almost felt like a few hours. Okay, I'm just gonna grab one because there's a big giant one uh, right beside me. I'm gonna need that. Oh. Well, I definitely needed it. Now, run away! This already feels like a definitely more of a nightmare than Gaddis ever does. Oh man, I spoke too soon. So the timing about this in this one is kind of, I believe you have to be kind of perfect to to accomplish this one. Oh, okay, maybe not. All right, uh, first I'm gonna keep him locked like this. Getting to seven enemy here. Okay, I can do it. Yes! In my first try. Now it's time for me to get the hell out of here. Get the hell out of here. Okay, this second stage here is... It was time consuming, but... I, I did it. That's all that counts. Just wait till Gadius gets, uh, gets a piece of my mind. Just for going through the all this frustration. Okay, now for the third and final door, I presume. Yeah, there's the third one because the fourth one is big. It's a big door uh, in comparison to the normal doors. Aw, oh, man. And when the door is big, that means the final boss must be behind that. If you guys ever ask me to, to do a, a Legend of Zelda Let's Play, that's an impossibility because... Oh, no! That's an impossibility because, first, I'm not that good at Zelda games. Second, I can't get into the Zelda games. I tr I did beat... I did beat the Ocarina of Time and Wind Waker, but that took me quite a long time to do. And I just didn't enjoy them as much as people may do. Because when I play them, it just wasn't that fun for me. I do like the dungeons, those are like the best parts of the games of course, but when going for the overworld, it feels it feels like I've been through I've been going hours without doing anything significant. Or anything that just is enjoyable because the overworld is ironically the least my most disliked times with the Legend of Zelda games as they there's just nothing there's just aren't a lot to do in it besides Okay, how should I call it? Especially when I played the Wind Waker because that there felt like I was just sailing for minutes just to go to another place. And that's the point. But as soon as I got the spell where I can just warp myself to a location, it felt like a blast because I don't want to sail another place just uh, just for minutes to come. At least we got this at least we got this swift seal item that makes you able to go faster, but Wind Waker is just not that fun for me. But over in the time I, I quite like. Now I'm just rambling about the Zelda games because I just I just want to talk some uh, talk about something. Okay, that didn't work. I have to get that that bounce right up there. But I have to wait until the look. <laughs> the platform comes. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay, what I'm just trying to say is, uh, the moment where I have to go through the dungeons in the Zelda games, I like it. But when I have to go through the overworld and try to definitely find a way, uh, find out what what I uh, have to do in the overworld, 
it's all just a, a, a one big lucky guess I had to do, uh, just in order to progress in the, uh, in the games. And that was like... And that took me a long time to figure out what I even had to do uh, as soon as I'm done with the locations and what I have to get. Or how I'm supposed to get to, let's say, a place uh, without that item. It was all big uh, lucky guess I had to do. And if I can't do that, I'll have to use an, a, a walkthrough to, to progress. And that was just not fun for me to do. Oh. Okay, can you please come here? Okay, why doesn't he appear? Oh, I guess they only appear when I um when I go uh, go down. Oh, gee. Ah. What? Oh, oh man. Okay, I must be stretching right now because God damn it, they're just taking me down one by one. I got him. Okay, I believe this is what I have to do. Okay, I'm doing better. Now to not fall down. Don't fall. Just one more time. Yeah. Ah, yes, this part. This may be difficult. But let's see here. Yes, I do remember the first time I had to uh, figure out what to do in this place. I basically... I nearly forgot that I can just... Uh, I can just use my my uh, wind bullet to shoot, to shoot the one down the middle. And that's why this level was so hard to figure out. <laughs> just because I didn't try to use my wind bullet on it. I thought it was use an enemy. I thought it was just so far away. But now... Surprisingly, this is the easiest one to do. Okay, good. And now that we're done with all three of them, we've opened up all the pillars, and now to face the final boss. Here it is. Is the final boss time? Please tell me it is. Almost. You're gonna love those ancient elevators. Well, here we are. Man, it's like flying out of the u universe. Zoom. Soon, the dark, the night crystal now Na too will be ready. But what is this? This dream? A dream that cannot be corrupted by nightmares. It must be removed. It must be eliminated. For the creation of the perfect Na too. A visitor, a traveler of foolish dreams. You want to be a Pokemon master, is that it? Foolish little boy, I got your precious Pikachu. You cannot be a Pokemon master without a Pikachu. I will not I did not anticipate you following me all the way here. Gadius, I'm here. Looks like you're a little too late, though. Why are you doing this? Why? I'm tired of this foolish world and neglects nightmares and relies only on pleasant dreams. This is reason enough, is it not? I thought you wanted to do this because of revenge. 
When Antum's released, you'll be erased too. It doesn't matter. Yeah, I've already abandoned, but I, this time it's my turn to abandon it. Such is life. No! Never! Very well. Meet your doom. At least, at least animate his lips when he's laughing. This one is not so hard. I just hope I can show you why it isn't hard. You <laughs> know, so I don't screw up. Okay, I don't want to do a, a, a Sonic Let's Play or uh, or Kingdom Hearts. I haven't played Kingdom Hearts for years. No! Alright, I already lost so many lives. Now I know it's not going to be easy. I'm just trying my hardest to grab an enemy. Boom! How do you like that, Doc? I do hope there's a heart just randomly appearing here. Because I only have enough for, for two hits. Okay, why did they appear here? Okay, I died. It's fine. I mean, look how many lives I've got. I can lose to him. Whoa! Okay, all I have to do is just go over here, and I'm back. At first I thought they were going to uh, uh, damage me, but no, it just got me to someplace else. He's almost dead! Ah! Whoa. And so am I! If I don't get the heck out of here. And this is why he's going to use another attack pattern. This one was really hard to figure out. Or maybe not that one. Uh, the other one, I think. Okay, they're coming. Oh. Okay, I can do it! Boom! They're coming... Oh, come on! Why did it have to be so hard to get them? Finally! I just hope I can defeat him right here and now, because my health is kind of low. Um. Okay, when is he going to use another attack pattern? I'm kind of waiting here. Boom! And another! Okay, that worked out pretty well. Well, if I was if I were as fast as Sonic, I could just run circles around him. Literally. Now I'm not exactly sure how I can use the enemies inside that one, but uh Okay, what's he going to do? Hey, that worked! Come on, just another one. Oh, I lost it. Mm. 
and the work again. Well, well, I did it. I lost. Or did I? Finally, it took me quite some time, but I finally beat Gedius. No more nightmares, Madman. But it's not over yet. Clonoa! Look what the cat dragged in. Or seafood. Everyone! Dang, I thought I'd have a chance to get him. Pfft, in your dreams. Get it? I knew you were up to the challenge. Please return now. Well done. Well done. I can't help but feel he's being really sarcastic about it. Oh no, Hupo. You're safe. Mother! I suppose we can finally celebrate. Yeah. Don't be so sure about that, bloppy boy. The night energy is already full. What? He has taken over a diva, and new tomb shall be reborn any time now. Well, that sucks. The world's dream passed through a pi uh, prism, a source of all that is phantomile. As long as there is the uh, power to see that po dream, no one can stop Naha too. No, that can't be! We're not finished yet! No one says it's gonna be easy. This strange dream, Nacho will erase it away. Hear this strange dream? The world is finished. And this is the beginning of the perfect nightmare. Oh no! Natum's awakened. He's going to open the door to Phantom Isle. We did see that egg at the begin at the ending of the Vision One of this level, and here he is, Natum. No, Natum is born. Gadius, he even added his own nightmare. Wait, there is still hope. Hope, oh, there is a final power, left by our ancestors for this day. It's time to combine the strength of the five tribes. Lend me your hands. right -o. Come on, everyone! Thank you. Now quickly, let's go above. We have to go. Come on, let's get going. No, no one. Natum is. Natum is after you. I mean, he did say he's going after this strange dream, didn't you? Here. Why me? That strange dream that you spoke up about is you, Klonoa. Wait, hold on. I know what you're talking about. <laughs> There's something you haven't explained to me yet, good old buddy. Is there a secret you kept from me? We're supposed to be friends. We have to go now. Hmm. Okay, I may I might have lied. I really thought this was going to be the final let's play part because But then I saw this final vision level, so I'm just gonna save it for later. See you guys later in more Clonoa Door to Fainter Mile. I need a rest.